Hello, my name is Dr. Alex Rutgers. I am the Director of Cleft and Craniofacial Surgery at Johns Hopkins All Children's Hospital. Today, I want to speak to you about a condition called Pierre Raban sequence. Pierre Raban sequence is a collection of three related findings. The first of these is called micrognathia, or a small jaw. In babies, that can result in poor support and floppiness of the tongue, or what we call glossoptosis. In patients with glossoptosis, the tongue has the potential to obstruct the airway and cause difficulty breathing. In these babies, corrective jaw surgery is sometimes necessary to address these problems. Not all patients with Pierre Raban sequence are the same. Some babies respond quite well to repositioning and the use of special bottles so that they can breathe and grow appropriately. Other babies require corrective jaw surgery, feeding tubes, or other surgical procedures to allow them to safely breathe and grow. We pride ourselves on multidisciplinary care at Johns Hopkins All Children's Hospital. When evaluating babies born with a small jaw, we typically partner with our colleagues in pediatric ENT, pediatric pulmonary medicine, neonatology, and speech and language pathology to identify babies who are at risk for difficulty breathing or an inability to normally feed and grow. In patients with these problems, we approach them in a team to craft a treatment plan that is optimized for each baby. Sometimes this requires feeding therapy, a temporary or surgically placed feeding tube, corrective jaw surgery, or other airway operations to maximize their ability to breathe. We want you to feel comfortable that we have the best team members for management of these complex newborn babies so that, you can, so that we can deliver the best results for your child. We look forward to meeting you and your baby so that we can help with their care.